What's up guys, it's Carter Kid, and today I'm going to be telling you what I think are the most difficult speed cubes. Now I'm specifically going to be comparing these two puzzles. First off, we got the MoYu 13x13. What I mean by this is any 13x13, but in this case I'm using the MoYu. And then we got the Boob Cube. Please clap. Now these two puzzles are arguably the most difficult puzzles of all time, and I'm going to be comparing these puzzles' different traits and what makes them difficult. At the end, I'll be giving my verdict on which puzzle I think is more difficult. Now let's go over some difficult aspects of each puzzle. So some difficult aspects of the 13 by 13 are 1, it's really big and it takes a long time to solve. Now moving on to the boob cube, looking at this cube, you probably think it's really easy. You probably think, oh, it's like the one by one, everyone makes it so hard. But actually, the one by one is actually pretty difficult. For me personally, I didn't know which cross color to start on, so I used the one by one as a die to decide which cross color to use all right orange cross i think this is going to be my pb and from there it's kind of hard to find your first layer corners so inspection is a big mess for one by one however with some practice you can get good like these pro cubers gray ktk and blue ktk you can see these handsome young men hold the world records in one by one blue ktk has an 859 single and gray ktk has a 901 average but the one by one is actually harder than it looks as for the boob cube, it's like a one by one, but even harder. There are a bunch of these extra layers and there are more pieces to look out for. So look ahead is much more difficult. Now to see which cube is more difficult, I'm gonna time a solve on both of these cubes and see which one I get a worse time on. Let's start out by scrambling the 13 by 13. You thought I was gonna really scramble this thing, huh? If I actually did a solve on camera, it would be so fast and it would blind you, but I slowed it down a bit. So here's a video. So as you can see, I got a really fast time there, but now let's try a solve on the boob cube. Okay, so we got a pretty tough scramble here. Uh, I think I can plan my, my first face, but let's see. This is so rigged, I can't even do R moves, what the heck? Okay, so I figured out how to do a U move. I just can't do the rest. What the heck? Dude, this is impossible. I can't do this. Now you might be thinking, Cartridge Kid, you're stupid. And you're not wrong. But it's not just me who has trouble with this. This is the only pamphlet that comes with a cube that I will actually use. Together we can solve this perplexing puzzle. If we open up the pamphlet, we can see all of the calculations made. This solution became obvious once we assumed the boob cube is massless and in a vacuum. Very good quote. The solutions in this menu were crowdsourced from scientists all over the world. These solutions are only theories that you should verify experimentally. We hope that the spread of scientific knowledge will one day lead us to a solution. Submit your own theory. And there are many quotes from very credible scientists here. And as you can see, the boob cube failed on Kickstarter. It was not featured in Business Insider, The Wall Street Journal, BuzzFeed, and Wired. Very cool. And as you can see, Cubicle Labs put magnets in a boob cube. And if you try to turn it, it makes it even more impossible to solve. So yeah. Yeah, as you can probably tell by this video, the boob cube is an extremely difficult puzzle. If you want to buy the 13 by 13 or the boob cube, or even a 1 by 1 make sure to get it from thecubicle.com and use code KTK. If you ever wanted to buy 100 GAN 12, you can save almost $400 with code KTK. Insane, right? Doing so gives you a 5% discount and supports my channel, so make sure to go do that. Also, thank you guys so much for 1.5 thousand subscribers. Maybe I'll do a giveaway and a Q&A soon, so stick around for that. Thank you so much for watching this video. Let me know if you want more comedy videos like this, and let me know if this video was actually funny. Thank you guys so much for watching. See you guys next time. Bye.